All right, let's take a look at what the day eight item is. Here we go. This purple looking one. Oh, wait. Maybe this is themed after uh, 1.9? Oh, it's a llama hat. Hey, interesting. Let's get it. Hey, we got the llama hat. Awesome. Now that looks cool. Ah, here we are. Back in the 15 year journey map. Okay, now, yesterday, we went through the Buzzy Bees section of the map. And today, uh, you know what? Today, I want to go through this green vanilla alpha. Hey, you know what? Let's go through alpha, because that would be awesome. Whoa. No way, guys. They are referencing the original version of Minecraft Alpha. Now, obviously, this isn't the oldest version of Minecraft for all you Minecraft nerds watching this video, but it's the oldest version that they're going to show here, and I still think it's really awesome that we get to see... Wait. They're playing... Sweden? That's the original Minecraft music. That is amazing. Wow. And these are the original textures. I love them more than the ones we have now. Alpha Minecraft, retroactively referred to as Minecraft Classic, marks the first phase of Minecraft's development where versions of the game were made available to the public. The Minecraft that first saw the light of day may look drastically different from the Minecraft we know today. However, the bright neon-colored palette and iconic flat clouds will forever remind us of where it began. This is so cool, wow. And what does this lever do? Vanilla blocks loaded. Hey! Oh, that's so cool, so we can see a comparison now. Of the modern-day Minecraft, its grass color and its textures. To how it used to look. Okay. Here. Let's take a good look at the grass now. And the sand. And watch what happens when I press the lever. Look at that. It turns way more pixelated. Wow. These are the blocks present in the early classic version of Minecraft. Now, if you're a true Minecraft fan, you'd know that Alpha was not classic. <laughs> They were two separate versions, but for this map, it makes sense. It would be easier to understand that they would just call Alpha classic. It wasn't classic. Alpha was the version of Minecraft that first started experimenting with survival. But they're not wrong with how many blocks there were. This really was it. Aside from uh, dirt and grass, really, it was just coal, iron, and gold. A simpler time. Wow, look at the cobblestone! Now this has taken me back. Starting exactly 15 years ago, in May 2009, pre-classic Minecraft began its first development phase. This version predates Minecraft Classic. In this very initial stage of development, the game was originally called Cave Game. It was later renamed to Minecraft Order of the Stone before finally adopting a name that would cement its 15-year legacy. Minecraft. That is so cool. Wow, I was not ready for this. Oh, what a blast to the past. I wonder, if I turn on the new textures, will that change the ones over there? No, it only changes these. In that case, we're going to leave it alpha. I love the look of it. Minecraft Sponge has had a roller coaster history. Initially, it could absorb water, but then this functionality was removed as the game's water physics evolved. And then in 1.8, its absorbing powers were reinstated and improved. Now it can soak up water in an area and be dried out for reuse. That is so cool. Old Sponge. Wow. Oh, I guess they're not going to show the new sponge. <laughs> That's fine. I thought they would. Okay. Oh, new sponge! Oh, I didn't know that! Wow, yeah, that is such an awesome use. It looks like uh, old sponges only really soaked up water when you place them, but then that feature got removed and then added back. That is so cool. 
Back in the old days, lava and water could fill massive areas with only one source block, creating vast oceans or fiery lakes from nothing. Oh, that's true. Yes, if you play actual classic Minecraft and you place down a block of water or lava, it will spread continuously because there was no way for the water to stop. Uh, yeah, and this is what the original water and lava looked like. And of course, if it was really classic, if you placed a water all the way there, and a lava all the way there, they would start spreading rapidly, and the whole glass would be just covered. So this isn't a good showcase of what it used to look like, but it's definitely a good showcase of the textures, so you can give it that. Wow. I think we're gonna save the middle room for last. Wow. It's like a display. Humans were an old hostile mob that were removed from the game. They looked exactly like the default ski skin that we know and love. Humans could be spawned by pressing G on your keyboard in classic mode. I didn't actually know that. And pressing G in this, uh, unfortunately does not spawn in a Steve. Wow, that is really how he moved! They got it so accurate! It looks like I can't press the lever again. Oh, it's just a single showcase, but wow, that really is the original Steve mob. Believe it or not. Wow, they even have his original textures. That's so cool. Wow, this is the best old Minecraft representation ever. I love it. I love all the references. This is so good, especially for kids who want to know about old Minecraft, right? And they never got the... What? Let me guess what this is supposed to be. Did you know the creeper was created almost entirely by accident? It was supposed to be a pig, but when the model was being built, the height and width values were mistakenly swapped, resulting in it standing up vertically. Oh, that's right. So here's the pig. And it looks like when the pig was first made, it was accidentally flipped. And so the creator of Minecraft, Notch, said, yeah, let's keep it in. Cool. Now let's head this way. The gaming room. Approach Steve to load into Alpha Minecraft? What? Wait, these are the developers, aren't they? Okay, looks like I can't do anything. Oh, it just hit me, wait. <laughs> this isn't a development room, it's a gaming room. Look at it, everybody's playing Minecraft. Some of them aren't even playing, they're just watching videos. You're watching a video of a cat. McKenna, I thought you were out taking photos. <laughs> no, she's too busy playing Minecraft, good for her, I'd be doing the same thing. Alright, Steve, you want to show me? Oh yeah, wait, I should probably mention. Here's the difference between Steve's old and new textures for those who don't know. Take a close look at this, Steve. Notice how flat he looks. Okay. Now keep a close eye on him. Very awesome, right? Now, if we take a look at the new Steve, you'll see what's different about him. And if you haven't noticed, Steve's shirt looks like it's rolled up. Now that's the biggest difference. Obviously, the shading is a lot smoother and his hair looks a lot different just by the lines. But yeah. Steve has had a bit of a makeover to look a lot more polished and clean, and I like it, and... Whoa. It's Alpha Minecraft! That's the... That's really the menu! Oh. My. Goodness. Wait a second. This isn't what I think it is. For those of you that know the creepypasta Herobrine, this is where the original photo comes from, and if you don't know Herobrine, he was an old myth. A Steve with no eyes would haunt your game. And, although it was proved false, what's this world doing here? <laughs> I can't run. And my hunger's gone, and my experience is gone. What? 
They really got it down! This really is Alpha Minecraft! I thought Mojang would never... Redstone didn't exist in Alpha Minecraft. Stand on the pressure plate to progress, that's right! Wow, this really is Alpha! Where's the pressure plate? What about Switch versions? Whoa. Whoa, whoa. <gasps> oh. It just hit me what we have to do. We have to switch to modern Minecraft. Oh, forget loading up Minecraft and looking at the differences. You can see them right there. So there were no little grass if you couldn't already tell. It was incredibly flat. And villages weren't a thing either. There's so much I could mention. There's nothing in that chest. So it looks like today we can see the beautiful village that's spawned. Hey, hey! That's <laughs> so cool. I am just blown away. Wow. You are dancing incredibly fast there. Okay, okay, enough stalling, enough stalling. Oh. <laughs> Did I mess it up? Oh, I see. Looks like the uh, past doesn't get affected by the future. That makes total sense, yeah. Man, sorry I skipped the explode. Whoa. Now that is a new Minecraft hill. So what happens if we go back? It's gone! And the fog shows up. Whoa, that's new. Yeah, it looks like old Minecraft's render distance was so bad that fog would be that far back. But nowadays, it looks so good. There's a villager up there dancing. There's bees. Wow. Really puts into perspective just how much they've added. Look at it. We can either fall into the lava or switch versions and see what happens. Oh, wow. Looks like lava didn't generate until after alpha. Hello. So what about all the pumpkins and beehives, huh? They were not there. Now we can see- ow, that hurts my eyes. Alpha lava, eesh. Alright, I gotta stop swatch, sw swapping so much. It probably hurts your eyes, I'm sorry. I'm just having so much fun. This is so cool. Hello! Okay, okay, one more swap. Let me get- wait, I don't think we can go through here. Unless we do swap. Because of all the dripstone. Yeah, it looks like it's, uh... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can we make a run for it? Nope, that's a one block gap that we can't make it through, so... Back then, there were no dripstone, but also there was no sprinting, so it's kind of annoying. Oh! I fell! Oh! Now I see what I gotta do. I can't make a run for it because I'll fall. So, I gotta come this way, stand on top of the cobblestone, Oh, how interesting. Oh. oh! Wait, that was the original hurt sound! So before Minecraft had that regular hurt sound, the it actually had an older sound that went, ooh, like this. Oh, that's so cool! Oh, I have to jump. I didn't even realize. Alright, so cobblestone is the key. Oh, this is amazing. Yep, we can't jump over there. Okay. What is uh what what does all this look like in the uh, alpha version? I'm so quiet. I'm just taking it all in. This is phenomenal. There's nothing. It was actually sectioned off. Okay. Eh. Oh, thank goodness it's only a one block gap. You couldn't sprint. Oh my gosh. I was not ready for them to do an alpha themed world. I'm so happy. Where do we go from here? Oh, we can climb these, right? No. Okay, wait. 
Oh, it's a puzzle. Okay. Oh. Then where do I head? I can climb up them. Okay, sorry if that hurt your eyes for all the unnecessary swapping. I just, uh, I was unsure because I've barely seen these. Like, I've seen them a few times. Oh. Okay, I thought it would drop. Never mind. But anyways, yeah, I've seen these a few times, but not that much. Because they're very rare. You have to find a lush cave. I know that. Wow, just what a cool section. I love this alpha section. Here we go. Swap time. Okay. We gotta jump over here. Jump over there. Jump down here. And check it out. We found ourselves in a mine shaft. Now we could walk through all that. But I don't know if I wanna. Oh wait, I don't think we have a choice. Yeah, we don't. Okay. In that case... Let's swap and walk through this way because there were no... Uh... What do you call them? Mine shafts, that's it. Yeah, there were no mine shafts in Alpha. I feel like you get the point by now. I don't know why I keep repeating myself. Every time I go back into Alpha, I say, Oh, this wasn't an Alpha! I'm sorry! You gotta understand how exciting this is. This is the original Minecraft! Whoa! And luckily there were no illagers, which means we can make a run for it. Okay. Let's go, let's go! Oh, good. Phew! Oh, wow. Thank goodness for hay. Whoa. Now this is going to be the most jarring difference of all. You block the exit. Oh. Aww. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen you. You're that new mob they added. Okay. And the original glass. Look at this chicken. It just hit me. So that's why we couldn't go through this sniffer. It's pretty much showing us. Here's the beautiful modern cherry blossom biome. But we head back in time. And check it out. We can walk right through a measly little... What'd I just do? Oh, I must have grabbed a chicken egg. Whoops, I didn't even realize that the chicken would have given me a sticker. <laughs> okay. And yeah, there was no uh, paths either, so it was all dirt. I'm sure you could have gotten that, though. What's over here? Oh, there's 100% Easter egg? No. Lily pads. There were no lily pads. Although Steve should be there because he was an alpha, but... I guess they didn't put him there because he would have been running around the way you saw him. So let's use the new lily pads. And by new, they're really not that new. Woo! Welcome to the party! Hey, thanks, Steve! Woo, you made it! Thank you, Alex! Wow. Nom 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 nom. I got the grass block! That's so cool. Then that means we are only missing one sticker. You know what? Let's go in and get it. Okay, upon closer inspection, it looks like I don't think I'm supposed to be up here. Uh... I don't know. I mean, the way the world cuts off really gives me the impression that, uh... You know... <laughs> I don't think I'm supposed to be up here. Okay, at this rate, something tells me this is not where I'm supposed to be to get the, uh... You know... <laughs> the stamp. Whoa! Look at me! I'm inside of the computer thingy! Whoa! 
It's not actually doing anything, I just thought it looked really cool. There it is! It was on top of the desk! What? Minecraft disc box? What? Is that supposed to be the Xbox edition? Oh, it 100% is. Take a look at that and take a look at the Xbox Minecraft. Now that is one heck of a throwback. Wow. Well, this alpha version has been a blast from the past and probably my favorite part of this world, even though we are nowhere near done it. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye!